back to another video. My name's Erica. If you're new, if you're not, thank you so much for coming back for another video. Today for me is Saturday and it's already afternoon, but I did have to finish editing this morning and do a few things. Marion and I just ran out. We got some stuff from Aldi, so I thought I'd start out this video with giving you a small grocery haul. I mean, it's, I say small, small for us. It's like my in-between grocery shopping weekend, so. Uh, yeah, so I'll show you what I got and then in a little while when I'm done with this I need to go out on the porch and do some cleaning because it's like not been cleaned since like last fall I guess and there's just a lot of stuff I need to clean up I want to pull out my flower boxes that Marion made me and put those out there and put away some of the winter decor I still have out there and then take down the windows and screens and clean them really good that's my plan at least hopefully I can do that I have no I don't think I've ever like fully cleaned those windows because they're kind of complicated so we're gonna do that but I thought I'd do a grocery haul a little different I'm just gonna pull each thing out and show you what I got I just went to Aldi I just didn't want to deal with Walmart today but I did have to go to uh, Target to get the very very teriyaki that Jackson loves so I did have to do that but everything else from Aldi got some potato chips so I got those chips and I also got some of this dill dip I've had homemade dill dip and it was so good so good and i need to get the recipe but this we'll try this i don't know if it's any good we'll have that with our burgers tonight got some strawberries because they were only like two dollars and a few cents got a big old bunch of bananas marion is loving his raisins lately so i got some more of those i got 10 of these frost drinks for jackson they're 55 cents each so cheaper than soda and they're a whole lot bigger and they're Wait, there are no sugar in them. Let me let these dogs in real quick. All right. That's all I've got in there. And I got some of these bagels. They're maple French toast bagels. They sound delicious. Jackson will love these. In the toaster with some butter. Got a cucumber. I'm going to make those chicken, hummus chicken non wraps again. I showed you those in another video. Oh my gosh. They were so good. And I have hummus left and I had a few things left so I was like I'm gonna buy this stuff to make those again. I got some egg noodle noodles. I'm gonna make that Olive Garden chicken one night this week. I got a big bag of basmati rice because uh, I'm gonna do more meal prepping for Jackson so he's loving chicken teriyaki and rice these days so I got a big thing of chicken tenders. This was 12.05 but it's really big. How many pounds is it? Three it's almost it's four pounds basically so that will be be surprised well you probably wouldn't if you have teenagers how fast that goes for him um i bought these just because he likes like rolls for his sandwiches at school they didn't have the ones that i get at walmart so i had to buy those hopefully he will like them got more of the mini garlic naan for our wraps they finally had my sourdough bread. They haven't had this for so long. I'm so excited. I love this sourdough bread. If you've never had it, it is so good. And then I have a thing of hot dog buns. It's been in my refrigerator because I'm going to grill some hot dogs tonight. But some of them I'm not sure. Like on the bottom, they feel a little hard. So I just grabbed a second thing to make sure we had enough. Marion always gets his black silk, but he bought this this time. He's going to try that. So we'll see if that's any good. And I got some uh, baby carrots to dip also in that dill dip. I thought that would be really good. Got their Tuscan Garden brand of all garden dressing so I can make that chicken. And then I got a couple tomatoes. I have some, but I wanted to make sure I had enough. And then the rest is just more of these frost drinks. These should be set. That's all I got from all these. So I need to put these groceries away. Marion's actually looking at the windows now. I'm gonna show you. They're like double pane, I guess. I don't know. So apparently I painted the window shut. I mean, I painted that multiple times. So, so it's, I'll show you from the outside. The lighting is terrible out here right now, but you can see up here in between the windows. I'm assuming that's like a mildew or something and I can never clean it. So he said you have to open the window and then we'll take this glass off and then the top one will fall down so we can take it out. Otherwise, there's no way to clean it. So it's a process. And this one over here, this one over here isn't as bad at the top, but the bottom 
it's pretty bad. So I'm gonna, hopefully we can get these cleaned off today. Y'all enjoying this? This It's like 65 degrees and sunshine, which it hasn't been sunny in a week here. But I still have this Christmas decor up. I left it up for winter because I thought it was pretty still. And just like my blanket and we have our snow shovel and our ice melt and Clyde. And I have like leaves and stuff. I just need to, hopefully it's, you can see this lighting is so bad. I just need to give it a really good cleaning. I'm going to put my uh, window boxes back up in the windows and put my spring flowers in them. Hopefully do some cleaning. I have a really pretty rug also and a new wreath I got. So I got the groceries put away, but I kept out these these brioche buns are so good, like so much better than just a regular bun. I got, I love to get those at Aldi. Got some hamburger buns. We're gonna have that dip and chips. And then these are the burgers I'm gonna grill. These are from Sam's, you get 18. I think that this is $25, but these are so good. And they're actually really big. Obviously they're gonna, you know, melt down. But I think I have like nine or 10 in here and I might just grill them all. We've had them for a while and when I made them inside, it made such a mess, so I've been waiting for good weather so I can grill them, and I'm just gonna grill them up, and then I can freeze them if I need to, or we'll eat them for, we'll probably eat them for a couple days for, we'll have leftovers. But you know, Mary, uh, Jackson and Marion can eat two at one meal, so I might as well just do them all, and then I have a whole thing of hot dogs and Marion's steak also. But I have, I wanted to show you this wreath. I got this with Madison, we were at Goodwill. We were fighting over it, but I found it first, <laughs> so I got it. Normally I'd give it to her, but I loved it. And I've been wanting a tulip wreath for so long, it was $3.99, and I need to do a little fluffing with it, but it's so beautiful, it's gonna be so pretty on my front door. And then I had, my mom gave me this um, garden flag for the front, so I'm gonna put that out there. And then I got this last year, I think I got it at like Ross, but it's so pretty, so that'll go on my, on my little doorstep at the front door. Is it gonna work? Um, I don't know. I gotta get all this stuff off first. This thing looks like it's sealed. So Mary's gonna have to actually take this whole... I guess that's not the actual window, but like no. the screen, it's like got double panes, I guess. And we've obviously never taken that off. We need new windows. But I'm gonna clean all this off too, cause that's the in-between that I can never get to. This lighting is so bad. He's having to get some tools and stuff and hopefully he can take this whole frame down, but I'm gonna go ahead and take down this uh, garland and also the no shovel and the ice, we don't need that anymore. Paint up there. Yep. <laughs> Success. Wow. All right. I guess I'll. I've cleaned the outside, obviously, but it's the inside. I'm just gonna use my spray spray away. I have no idea if all this will come off or not. This is, that's all on 
the other side, so I'll clean the outside first. We'll see, because this has been here forever. Mary's gonna use this window glazing and just, this house is like 80, 80 some years old and these windows, I think, are original. We've replaced a few of them, but these are not replaced yet. So the caulking was some, starting to come off. So, well, a lot of it was coming off. So he's just gonna reglaze, not reglaze, is that, that's not glazing. Yep. Yes, <laughs> reglaze them. It does look so much better though. It's gonna be so nice to be able to see out that window and not see all those spots on it. These are my window boxes that Marion made for me a couple years ago and I use them for spring and summer and fall and then I put them up for Christmas or winter and then I pull them out every spring so I just have these same flowers that I had last year these kind of like bluish bluish greenish purple um, hydrangeas and then some white ones and then I'm just gonna straighten up like all the greenery in there and then I put these in the two windows and they're so beautiful they're custom size custom for our window sills so I love them so much
usually happens <laughs> every time I'm out there cleaning my porch off I'm fighting that setting sun and it is totally drowning it out so I tried to get some good shots but the whole time we were out there it was just terrible lighting and I apologize we did get the one window finished the other one we did not take off it was like such an ordeal you know as you saw Marion had to take a whole thing apart I had no idea it would be that involved he always does he's always saying it's, it's not going to be simple and easy it's going to be involved so we did the one the other side the other window was not nearly as bad i don't know why that one window was so bad but that it feels so nice to have all that cleaned off so now every time i open my blinds i won't be looking through that filthy dirty window so as soon as the sun is like set and the lighting is so much better i'm gonna go out there and put a few more things out and then i'll show you what it looks like i would love to get like some really pretty like checkered pillows for the bench like some springy pillows so i'm gonna be on the lookout for that i don't know if i need to order some pillowcases from amazon i might just do that because it's usually cheaper um and then i also want to order some for the backyard too i need like outdoor fabric so um yeah i need to look for that so that'll be in the future but right now i think i'm gonna go ahead and start the grill because it's like almost 5 30. i had been thinking about maybe putting this bench out there this is still in my pantry and the only thing is if i put this outside we won't use it for shoe stores we won't leave our shoes outside and i feel like it's just going to get over time it's just going to get weathered and ruined so I am still not sure what I'm going to do with this, but it is definitely in the way in here. I don't want it staying in here, so I have to figure that out. But I'm not going to put it on the porch just yet because I'm just, I just don't think it's going to last out there. Even though it's undercover, I just feel like eventually it's going to mess it up. I pulled out my grill. My plan is for us to get a new grill this summer. I like charcoal, charcoal grills, so I probably will get another charcoal grill, but just a new one. This one's been around for a couple years, so I'm going to clean it out and then light it up I didn't realize that I only had a small amount of this charcoal I have some of the other kind that you use the the uh, lighter fluid on but I'm gonna see if that's enough Marin would tell me that's not enough so I do not know but let's clean this thing out also I like uh, use the leaf blower and try to get some of the, it's everything is so wet because we've had so much rain lately so once summer comes or not in the summer before then I'm gonna get out here and get everything off really good and then I'm going to power wash it and then it will look so nice it will be so much better I was wrong I have the same kind so we're good So the sun has set now the lighting is not that great but at least it's not drowned out from all the sunlight this is usually the one i keep up in the spring but i'm going to replace it this time with that tulip wreath this is the garden flag my mom got me she said it just looked like me. She thought I'd love it, so I, I do. I love that it's got the cross and the eggs. It's so pretty. And the lamb and the Easter lily, so I'm gonna stick this on my little flagpole. My daffodils are blooming. They always bloom so early. And then they're gone when everything is starting to get green. But it means spring is coming. Pretty soon in a, week, a couple weeks or a month or so, I'll plant some really pretty spring flowers in here and then I have to cut all these back and it'll look a lot nicer, but not quite ready for that.
Marion went ahead and put everything on it. Oh, it's so smoky. I am so ready for grilling weather. <laughs> This is the dill dip, rich and creamy dip with real sour cream and dill from Aldi. I'm going to open it up and see if it's good. You want a chip? Mm-hmm. It's weird. I can't eat sour cream on anything. But if it's mixed in with something, <laughs> I don't know why. I can eat with them, but those are good. That's good. All right, I made him burn the hot dogs. Woo! <laughs> Some of these are pretty done. Marion ended up doing all the grilling, so I didn't even have to cook it. It's delicious. Chloe, she smells all the food and she wants some. Oh, <laughs> Clyde too. Y'all wanna eat? Y'all wanna bite? This floor is not picking up, I don't think, but it's pretty disgusting just from all the tracking in and out. So I'm going to clean the floors, run the vacuum, and then we're going to sit down and watch a show. And I can relax because my back is hurting. <laughs> in but I'm gonna do that tomorrow my back is hurting so sometimes it's just the way it is but I do feel like I got everything done today that I really wanted to do got my list checked off tomorrow is Sunday and I have another whole list of things actually for me hopefully you've already seen it but for me I'm gonna finish up our bedroom makeover because if you've seen that video we did um, or I did the what is it called gel stain on the dressers and the nightstands today's Saturday 
I did it on Tuesday and it's still tacky. So we have the fans blowing. Clyde, leave her alone. We have the fans blowing on it and we're trying, we're hoping. We're hoping that tomorrow we can move them back and we can like finish and I can get that video done. But that video should be coming out before this one. So I hope that you saw that. If you didn't, I will link it above. But thanks so much for hanging out with me again. Hopefully this gave you some spring cleaning or, or uh, decorating motivation. I'm getting so excited for summer, spring, cookouts, the pool, the beautiful weather. I'm so excited. So definitely days like today make me excited so anyway thank you so much for watching thank you so much for commenting i love you all so much i appreciate you i'm praying for you and i'll see you in the next one Bye bye